Hello everyone and welcome to yet another video and today I'm going to teach you guys how to configure networking on 86 box with PCAP. So let's jump into that fresh install I made to install 86 box in my first video of my 86 box series. And now we're going to open Microsoft Edge, God forbid, and uh, <laughs> we got to go on Google. It's quite slow. It's a virtual machine running off an external hard drive. So God, it's a little slow, but it works. So you type in NP cap like so. There you go. Click there and you download the installer 1.20. It's really lightweight. There you go. You open it and then you click on I agree install NP cap. And it's going to do just that. Okay, completed. That's about it. We have NPCAP already installed and working on our Windows 10 install. So we go on 86 Manager. I'm going to import test VM, import VM files from the folder documents, VMs. We have this DOS test VM. It's going to complain. It could not be imported. It's, uh, it's not really a problem. So we go on configure. As you can see, it loaded the settings just fine. We go over to network, and here's where things have to be changed. So network type PCAP, you select your internet uh, card. It doesn't work on, wi on Wi-Fi, apparently. So bear that in mind. you got to be on Ethernet to make PCAP work. So there you go. Just make sure. Everything checks out here. Click OK. And that's about it. The machine's already able to network. And we're going to make sure that right now. So let's start this MS DOS virtual machine and demonstrate networking on Microsoft DOS. Please bear with the machine. It's quite slow. It's going to boot eventually. It's just awfully slow. There you go. Load failure. It's not a problem. Ignore that. So go. Uh, folder would be yeah. We got to start packet drive first. There you go. And then we change folders to MTCP. There. We hit DHCP. Oh yeah, I gotta have the config MTCP. Set MTCP CFG to a network CFG. There you go. Now if we go and oh wrong command DHCP. There you go. There you go. We have an IP now. It's working just fine. And we can see by pinging Google. See we have networking. Ain't that amazing? So yeah, that's about how you get PCAP working on Windows 10. Pretty simple. If you guys want, I can make a more advanced video showing how to configure networking from scratch. Because of course I imported this uh, machine from my computer. So I already had most of it set. I just had to, you know, get PCAP working. But everything was already, you know, the ground, the groundwork was already done. Most of it, everything was already laid. I just had to, you know install pcap per se and you just you know if you guys want to learn how to make uh, a bunch of network on microsoft DOS or even windows 95 98 just so uh, you know hit me up on the comment section down below but yeah that's basically how we get um pcap working on windows 10 that's it for the video hope you guys enjoyed it a really really quick one but yeah y'all yeah, take care